How's it going, riders? My name is Patrick from Bikeberry. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, mix the uh, oil in with our gas today. Um, there's just a few things you wanna uh, remember first off is uh, when you're mixing and braking in your engine, you wanna go two tanks at 16 to one ratio with your oil. Um, we're gonna go ahead and use a synthetic blend. We recommend a synthetic blend or better, just a full synthetic. Uh, pay more for your oil now because in the end, it'll just make your engine last a whole lot longer. Um, we're also going to go ahead and use our Maxima Quick to Mix bottle today. It's going to make our lives a lot easier. Um, they have all kinds of different mixture um, measurements on here. I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate how to mix the oil. We're going to go ahead with the 16 to 1 ratio. Uh, this is one gallon of gas, so we're going to go ahead and mix in eight ounces of our, uh, of our oil. So let's go ahead and do that right now. I'm going to go ahead and open the oil. I've already cracked the seal. We're gonna go ahead and use our quick to mix bottle. Um, it already has the markings on it. Right here on the side, we have the uh, eight ounce mark. I'm gonna go ahead and pour that in here. We're gonna line that up with the eight ounce mark. So we're at eight ounces here. I'd recommend a funnel if you can. Uh, makes it a much, much easier to mix the uh, oil in with your gas here. This is gonna be a little tricky because I forgot my funnel. So we're gonna go ahead and try to baby this in here. There we have it, that's the mixture. Uh, the oil is now mixed with the gasoline. Mix it up as well. Forgot about that. I'm gonna mix this as well as possible. And then... uh, when you're in the breaking in period, make sure that you do not go over 20 miles an hour or so. Um, you wanna vary the RPMs, make sure that the engine kinda just breaks in softly. You don't wanna push it too hard. That's just once again gonna just make that engine last a whole lot longer. You don't want to run it for too long. We recommend less than a half hour, 20 minutes, very short period of time. Just run it for the first two tanks. Make sure that when you run it, it's nice and cool when you start it up the next time. You're just gonna break that engine in and it's gonna run really well. If you have any other questions or comments or any other ideas that you might have for videos with us here at Bike Berry, um, just go ahead and comment below. Let us know if anything we can go ahead and help you guys out with. Uh, my name is Patrick with Bike Berry and thank you for watching the video.